Welcome back to another episode of Nate Tech. This is going to be vlog number 17. Uh, it's just a quick product overview. Uh, one of the new products that I've actually had for a while, but I haven't released it yet. Uh, kind of waiting for a couple other things to get done and kind of ramp down a little bit so that I could get this one going. This is a cell phone holder and it's not a universal one. This is made per phone. And this isn't kind of the final product. I've got another one printed right now, but I took out this hole and I put another one right down here in the center uh, so you can grab, grab the phone out. Um, the way this works is on your radio console, this, let me do it this way here. There's a little hook in the back, just hooks on. It's centered here. It just hooks on and you just push down and it clips on. It's that simple. There are some ridges, if I can, there we go. So it actually lines up with two of these ridges so that it doesn't, you know, you can't move it side to side. It locks itself in, can't go front to back. So pretty much just a set piece. It clips in, there's no tape, no screws, no anything. You just pull this out a little bit, clip it on, push your radio console back in, you've got a cell phone holder. And it does not, if you guys do have a clock, I have this sit low enough to where it does not block your clock if you do not have your cell phone in there. Nice bonus right there. I am working on, so this will work. I do have one for the wagons since they do have a different radio console. Uh, it's a little bit deeper and the, the hooks are a different design. So I've got that one done. It's actually out being tested right now. I've got uh, a guy that I just sent it to. He should get it here in the next day or two. So once I get that, that part tested, these will go up on the website. The things that you're gonna have to include and I'm going to try to get it built into PayPal, but uh, I need to know the width. So when you have your cell phone sideways, I need to know the full width of your cell phone, preferably in millimeters, because that's what my program works in. And then also the thickness. So when you set it in, it, it'll hold it fairly tight. I give a little bit of slack on it just so that it slides in and out nice. But I mean, you know, a millimeter, millimeter and a half on each side, it, it's not going to move on you at all uh, or come out. So this is the new piece. Like I said, they have to be custom designed for each phone. So if you've got multiple phones, you know, this is this is just a spare fun thing that I did for myself. I've had a few guys ask about it because I posted pictures. So if you are interested, let me know. These are only going to be $20 shipped because uh, they are so small and light. Uh, I'm not going to be normally doing my normal $8 shipping, uh, at least for the US. Uh, no additional charge if you guys are purchase them with something other with other things it's just a straight 20 bucks for this because it does take my time to custom adjust it for each each person that orders these should go up on the website here in the next week or so one of the other pieces I'm working on related to the cell phones the CRX is have a completely different dash as all of us know so what I'm gonna try and do this is what their uh, vent and clock look like I'm actually gonna make a piece that replaces the clock. Yes, I know you guys like clock, but if you got your radio, your cell phone in there, you've got a clock on the cell phone. So it's not a complete done deal. All you're gonna to have to do is take out two screws. There's one on each side, pull your clock out, and then it'll be a two piece cell phone. You'll slide the front piece in, and there'll be a back plate that screws in here, and then there'll probably be two screws that screw into the back so that it holds itself together. Then there would just be a cell phone. I'm gonna to try to set it to where it basically takes up. It's not gonna block the vent. It might go down just a little bit below this, this line here, the bottom of this, but it shouldn't get down low enough where it's gonna interfere with your uh, climate controls. The worst case scenario, I can make this a hair shallower top to bottom. That one will be coming out very soon. It's not that difficult of a piece to make as far as design goes, because I pretty much can just copy what Honda has already put together. I just got to sit down and do it. If you guys have any questions or comments, make sure you post them below or any suggestions. I am open, also open to custom things. If somebody wants a custom cell phone made, mount made somewhere, um, I'm up for it. So hit me up, social media, natentech.com. Uh, has all the links to the social media for Facebook and Instagram. I do try to reply to those as quick as possible, as long as it's not three o'clock in the morning. Uh, 
make sure you subscribe. I am trying to put out videos at least once a week. Now that I kind of get back into the school thing and we're past the summer, uh, things have kind of calmed down a little bit for me. Let's see. So subscribe, like this video, comment below if you guys have any suggestions, and we'll see you next time.